Hey everyone, welcome to lesson three. This lesson is all about discovering the presence that we've discovered in lesson one and two and applying that to our surroundings, applying that to objects, to the appearance of things inside of our consciousness. So for the purpose of this lesson, just uh, before you start reading, it might be good to grab an object. This object can be anything, but maybe have it be a simple homogeneous material kind of object, like a like a pen or a cube of wood or something like that. doesn't really matter. Just pick an object that perhaps you resonate with, that you feel some kind of appeal to, but even that doesn't really matter. So any object that is that you can just place on, um, on your table, on your desk or in front of you for the purpose of the exercise to follow in this lesson. And you'll see that as you go through that exercise, as you go through that practice, you can start to get a really sort of wacky, real, vivid, expanding, sense of the presence inside of things. You can start to emphasize that things actually are or have presence rather than that they are separate individual things. So that shifts one's focus in everyday life as well because everything you practice during your time with Trinfinity Academy, you will see that naturally that type of consciousness, that shift in perception will start to pervade your everyday life, your everyday activities. And so while you're going about your business in everyday life, you'll start to see that you get a real sense of the presence of things rather than the names that we give to things or rather than unconsciously assuming that you're working with a bunch of things. You bring this spaciousness, this consciousness, this presence, first of all, with yourself, your own state of being starts to carry a greater sense of awakeness, of presence. But then also in that greater spaciousness, you'll start to notice that the door, the pen, the person in front of you, your car, the road, planet Earth, space, they're all being present. They're all ising. They're all present. They're all existent. And so you start to tune into that resonance, into that vibration, into that presence rather than your labels about things. So that's really the purpose of this exercise is to have you experientially expand more into your environment as well and extend that sense of presence, not only to I exist, but also to everything else exists, so that we can start to see that there is no separation between I exist and things exist. And that in fact, it's the same isness, it's the same presence energy that is manifesting itself as your body, as your mind, as the space in between yourself and the object, and finally as the object. They're all consisting of the same presence, of the same energy. So have fun, this can be a really enjoyable experience if you allow it to be.